So my beautiful people and mages out there, today I bring you another Elden Ring video. Today guys, I showcase a talisman I think you're gonna want. How's it going guys? My name is DPG and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Elden Ring, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so there's so many talismans in this game guys, which will fit your, uh, your mage build, no doubt about it. But this one, I think you may substitute one of the ones you're using for it. It is called the Cerulean Amber Medallion Plus 2. And what this does, guys, it gives you an extra 30 focus points. Count them. 30 focus points, guys. Now, if I take this off, you can see. Now, the difference is quite a chunk, to be honest. It's quite a chunk. Here we go. Let me put it back on. And there we have it. So, what's that about? Well, mine's quite high anyway. I'm not sure what my level is in my... 50, 50, 50 people, 50, 50, yeah, so mine's quite high, but yeah, the Cerulean Amber Medallion Plus 2 is one I think you're definitely going to want in your life, so how this is got, well, firstly guys, you need to have completed the Rani quest, now this is, well, I've made a guide, complete guide in the video description, I don't need to uh, run you through the details of it, but yes, it starts at Rani's Rise, right up here. Uh, firstly, to get there, you need to clear out Carrier Manor. That means defeating uh, Loretta from here. Then you can just run through, guys, and start the quest. As long as you've already spoke to her previously, which I believe you need to speak to Rena first, who's at the early, her early days of the Church of Ella. So yeah, guys, do what you gotta do, and you'll end up right here. This is literally towards the end of Rani's quest. Um, basically, 95% in. You come to this area right here guys and you can only get to this via Rani's quest line simple as that now once you get here guys and you're at the moonlight altar you want to come to the lunar estate ruins as you'll see me doing on screen now now you will need a stone sword key i do believe to open up the chamber this is locked in but you've probably got plenty spare so go get this thing guys it's definitely worth it in my opinion people and there we have it guys, if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out, if you like what you see and want to see more Elden Ring be sure to subscribe and hopefully people I will see you on that next one.